Hey guys, it's me, Carrie, and I am back with another video for you. This one is a wonderful gift that I received today. I was posting on Instagram a week or two ago, I think, and I happened to post a comment on to write love on her arms. I'm not going to get in depth into what to write love on her arms means, but suffice it to say, it is an organization founded to show support and acceptance and love and solidarity for people who suffer from mental illness, eating disorders, self-harm, just a myriad of issues that make people feel isolated and alone. To Write Love on Her Arms is a wonderful organization that provides advocacy and support and kindness. And I follow them on Insta and I posted something about just really struggling a lot and I don't remember what that particular day it was it might have been nothing you know it might have just been an ordinary day in the life of someone with depression and anxiety and it was just kicking my butt extra hard and I posted a comment and I received a response from a company called find your anchor and they are based apparently out of San Clemente California and they just commented and said we want to send you a find your anchor box please pm us your address and of course you know my skeptical mind thought okay this is a scam because most people that reach out to you and offer you free stuff or say like you know oh you should be a model for us or oh you know we have a product that you really need to try it ends up being a sales pitch of some kind but i for some reason i just thought they didn't have to reach out to me i wasn't even on their page i was on to write love on her arms this page and it just, something about it felt authentic and legit to me. So I wrote and I did send them my address and we corresponded a little bit. And I thought, wow, this is really, really cool. Of course, I, you know, I Googled the name first and I went to their Insta page and checked them out. And basically they will send you or someone that you care about or even complete strangers, these boxes free of charge. And they're just designed basically to remind you to find your anchor, whatever that anchor may be, to know that when you're struggling, whatever your struggle may be, whether it's mental illness, whether it is, again, self-harm and eating disorder, you know, having a rough time just trying to survive in the LGBTQ community in a world where everyone's not so open to that, they will send these boxes to you or someone you love absolutely free. And it's just meant to provide encouragement and support. So this is the to find they to find your anchor box that i just received and here is the anchor logo on the top and it's blue which of course is my favorite color sky blue is my absolute fave but i'm not going to complain about this royal sea blue because it's beautiful and i have no idea what's going to be in here but i'm really excited so let's just open this up and see okay this is the inside of the box and you can pause and read this if it's able to be read i hope the light is good just in case it's not, I'm going to read it to you really quickly anyway, guys. It says, this is for you. This is my gift to you. If any of these words describe how you are feeling, then this box is for you. Lost, hopeless, suicidal. Two out of three at the moment. <laughs> if none of this pertains to you, please leave the box where you found it for someone else in need. So they actually leave them in random places as well. Oh my gosh, that's so powerful. As the keeper of this box, it is your responsibility to pass it along when you are ready. Thank you. And then inside, it has a post-it note. Oh my gosh, it's a personalized note with an anchor. And it says, you are so incredibly loved, Carrie. Oh my gosh, look at that. That is amazing. Oh my gosh, I will save this forever. It's going to go up on my bulletin board in my room so I can see it every day. Okay, so I have that. And then there's a little card inside here. And it's got the anchor on the back and it says to the hopeless, the worn out and the disenchanted. Well, hello there. You don't know me and I won't pretend to know you, but I've been where you are. I know that sadness, that feeling of despair. I know that hopelessness. I want you to know it can get better. There can be hope that there is help. FYI, you see this necklace that I almost always wear around my neck. That's why I wear it as a physical touchstone to remind myself of all those things so this couldn't be more perfect for me i'm not going to tell you it's easy because you already know it isn't there isn't one simple answer pill or book to make it all better i wish there was me too 
Instead, what I can offer you are some ideas that helped me. Look through the box, see what you think. The world is an amazing place and there are people who care. There are things that can help. There is hope. You've already started, you opened the box. A stranger who cares. And then at the bottom it says, there is hope. And of course, this will be going in my junk journal too, with all kinds of special things to remind me of this box. <laughs> so I'm really, I'm, I'm already moved. All right, and then in here, first thing I see next, the next thing I see, good grammar, Carrie, former English major, but not the sharpest knife, is this awesome rubber bracelet. And it says, find your anchor. You are so incredibly loved. <laughs> oh my gosh. There it is. Oh my gosh. Okay. On to the bracelet wrist it goes. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Okay. And next thing I see is unlimited edition 52 plus reasons to live. Oh my gosh. Find your anchor and there's the anchor and I'm not going to read all of these obviously but instead of it's like so delicate I'm just like holding it like with reverence because it's so special oh <laughs> this is the very first one coming home and look at that little cat nose <laughs> could that be more perfect for a triple cat mama I don't think so and believe me more often than not my babies are my reason to keep going that's for sure they are my fur children I can't actually have biological children I'm I have broken lady parts and I'm also now 45 years old so <laughs> yeah children will probably never be a part of my future human children but my cats sure as hell are so that's amazing and I can't wait to read those in private Next thing is this gorgeous sticker, like the one on the cover of the box. And I was hoping there'd be one in there because I really wanted ones because I want to put it someplace important to remind me to hold on when I find that it's hard to do that. Next thing, it says, become a messenger. Find your anchor at gmail.com. There is hope. And findyouranchor.us is the website. So if you go to this page, or go to this email address. I will post it in the Dropbox as well. You can send a box to someone that you care about or receive a box yourself if you need one. I would imagine that's exactly what this is designed for. And I'm just blown away. And just an FYI, they do, I believe, take donations on their page. We're not obligated to pay for these boxes. This box was sent to me for free, not because I'm someone special that has a YouTube channel because they didn't know that when they reached out. They just reached out because they knew I was a human being that was struggling. You too can receive one of these boxes. You don't have to have a YouTube channel or social media presence. You just have to go to the website and ask or, or write them an email. Then the next thing in here is a list of resources. There are actually two of these, which is fantastic because one I will keep, it says fold it up and keep it in your pocket just in case. And I will keep one of these and I will give one of these to my husband who suffers from bipolar disorder because we will both feel a lot better having these on hand if we ever were to need them. And certainly to share with friends, we can make copies to share with friends. And it says here, find your anchor. And it's all kinds of kinds of statistics. It shows reasons why you may feel depression, other than that you just are biochemically engineered to be depressed, which I am. And it's got all kinds of information about suicide and things you can do to reduce stress, listen to music, express yourself, go for a run, take a hot bath, all kinds of wonderful bits of information. And again, the ever-present anchor to remind you. And then there is a wonderful letter inside here. And I won't read this whole thing, but if you get a box, I'm sure you will get the same letter inside. I'm gonna read that later in my private time. And then next up you get, is this a poster? I think this is a poster. Often, okay, change often occurs when we are ready to give up, it says. This is true. And that's just a cool poster to remind you again that you never know what be may be around the corner. You never know. And if you give up, I guess you'll never find out is the point. And there is a button inside. 
with the anchor on it, just a little back, metal back button. And then there is another inspirational poster. You are not weak. And look at that beautiful surfing, peaceful scene there. I love the ocean. I'm a Long Island girl, so I mean, I'm not comfortable if I'm not within, you know, half hour, 20 minutes of an ocean. I've never lived farther than that from the ocean, even when I was in Florida. And then at the bottom of the box, it says, oh, and by the way, please pass the, this along when you are ready. I hope you will add your own special touches, throw in some lyrics, a photo, a phone number, anything that helped you, anything that made a difference. The more that is included, the better the odds that this box will help someone in need. But first, they have to get it. So pass it on. Thank you. Find your anchor. So seriously, you guys, I find your anchor. I am so touched. I'm so sorry I was a skeptic, but you can't be too careful these days, especially on social media, because a lot of people pretend to be your friends and pretend to care about you and they have ulterior motives so it's easy to get swept up in the negativity and the toxicity that can sometimes be present out there but obviously find your anchor is proof that there is also beauty and hope and kindness and just compassion so guys i hope this video meant something to you thank you find your anchor i'm it is the least i can do it is my honor to share the contents of this box on this channel and let people know that you exist again if you wish to contact them the links will be in the drop box uh, feel free to do that if you can find it in your heart to make a donation so they can keep on doing this for people that need it i'm sure they would appreciate that you'll find all that information on their website but this really touched my heart. So I'm very, very, very grateful and humbled and appreciative. Have an awesome rest of your day, you guys. Know that there is always hope, no matter how dark things may look, as we've often shared on this channel and will continue to in the future. I love you all so, so much. And thanks for watching. I'll be back soon with more stuff. Bye, guys.